The Secret by Rhonda Bryan. Reading Rhonda Bryan's book, The Secret, will teach you how to use the secret, the hidden power within you, to enhance every aspect of your life, including your finances, relationships, and health. If you like the sound of this book, you can get it for free with a trial of Audible using the link in the description. Here is a summary of the primary takeaways from the book. Lesson 1. The law of attraction is the secret. What is the secret? According to Brian, the secret is the law of attraction, one of the 12 spiritual laws of the universe. Brian goes on to note that the law of attraction is the secret to all wealth, happiness, abundance and everything else you may want in your life, because it governs the universe. She further notes that the law of attraction will help you access the immense untapped power within you because it is the law that determines the complete order in the universe, every moment of your life and every single thing you experience in your life. In case you are unaware or have never heard of the law of attraction before, it states that like attracts like. In The Secret, Brian notes that because you attract things you think about often or the most, by being meticulous about what you think about, you invite anything you want. She notes that your life right now is a reflection of your past thoughts. That includes all the great things and all the things you consider not so great. Since you attract what you think about most, it is easy to see what your dominant thoughts have been on every subject of your life, because that is what you have experienced until now. According to Brian, to use the secret to create the life of your dreams, pay attention to your thoughts and emotions. They become things. Brian communicates this sentiment beautifully when she quotes John Azaraf. You become what you think about most, but also you attract what you think about most. Lesson 2. Your thoughts have power. One lesson that will become stark as you read the book is that your thoughts have immense power. She notes that everything, your words, beliefs, values, emotions and actions, is a result of thoughts. She compounds this by saying, your thoughts become things. Remember that your thoughts are the primary cause of everything. If you are keen and aware enough, you will realise the truth in this. Everything man has created, be it cars, rockets, buildings and all other inventions, started as thoughts. She implicitly states, your life is in your hands. No matter where you are now, no matter what has happened in your life, you can begin to consciously choose your thoughts and you can change your life. There is no such thing as a hopeless situation. Every single circumstance of your life can change. Brian's book teaches you that thoughts are the source material from which all things come. Therefore, pay attention to your thoughts. Where your primary beliefs do not align with what you want, change them. Lesson 3. Ask, believe and receive. According to Brian, for the law of attraction, aka the secret, to work for you, you need to apply three key steps. The first is to ask the universe what you want. The second is to believe you will get it. And the third is to expect to receive it. To apply the first step, she advises becoming deliberate about asking the universe for what you want. She also mentions that the universe is always listening and always answering. She states, the truth is that the universe has been answering you all your life, but you cannot receive the answers unless you are awake. To ensure it gives you the answers you want, become aware enough to notice your related thoughts and emotions. On how to apply the second step, Brian emphasises that, see the things that you want as already yours, know that they will come to you at need, then let them come, don't fret and worry about them, don't think about your lack of them, think of them as yours, as belonging to you, as already in your possession. On the final step, she advises feeling as you would if what you want was yours right now. She states, when you want to attract something in your life, make sure your actions don't contradict your desires. Think about what you have asked for and make sure that your actions are mirroring what you expect to receive and that they are not contradicting what you asked for. Act as if you are receiving it. Do exactly what you would do if you were receiving it today and take actions in your life to reflect that powerful expectation. Make room to receive your desires and as you do, you are sending out that powerful signal of expectation. Don't forget, you can get this book for free with a trial of Audible using the link in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.